This whole breast cancer thing has been full of ups and downs. Take the other day, for example. I was in my vehicle. I was on the phone with my sister. I was sitting there talking, and I flipped the visor down. Thought I'd check the... See if I had any hairs on my chin, pluck them out. And right before I flipped that visor down, there must have been a piece of the longest hair that I have. And it just fell on my chin. Just sat there and dangled. I didn't know this until I flipped the visor down and I looked at it and I thought, that is the longest hair. I cannot believe people have not told me I had that hair. They got sympathy for me that I got breast cancer. And, and about that time, I tapped it and it fell off and I realized it was from the hair of my head and I felt such relief, such relief. And that's pretty much how this whole process has went. It, it just is full of highs and lows. Um... I got a call from the doctor telling me that there's only going to be one um, chemo instead of two chemos. So that's nice. I also found out that I do start chemo on the 28th. And it's a 12-week process. So I got the old calendar out and started marking it. And 12 weeks is a long time to do chemo. I don't know why they can't just do it in like a day or two, but 12 weeks is a pretty long time. Um, and I don't think I can back out. I think I should go ahead and go on through this process. And um, I think being at the end of chemo will be very nice. And going through it will be very inconvenient. So, uh, just wanted to give you an update, tell you I love you, and have an awesome, awesome day.